Hello everyone, welcome back to another session of Guild Wars 2. Well, I've been working on her, on Jessica's cooking. And, well, um, as you see down at the bottom, uh, there's no more level bar. We are at level 80. So, with that done, we're taking our wardrobe off. And yeah, we're going to take her outfit off. And I already purchased everything. Let's go right down here at the bottom. I already got her equipment. We are going to equip her with the celestial embolized embolizone. Excuse me, can't pronounce that. Mm. Uh, armor set and we've got runes we are going to equip with her which is the runes of scholar I got six of them that will increase her power and her ferocity which is awesome <clears throat> her weapon we're gonna add a sigil of impact and a sigil of force increase her damage exponentially weapon wise we got our level 80 exotic bow a berserker and two berserker axe axes so huh we just got her get her equipped for level 80 um one person did comment i uh, do want to thank him the comment should be shown on screen um, and he's just to go, uh, Soul Beast for our main skill, the, uh, elite skill. So, you know what? I'm going to do it. We're going to go Soul Beast for his elite skill. And where's my skills? I've got 13 points. Not really enough. Go down here to the Soul Beast. You need 30 just to pop the first one. These are pretty expensive, but it is one of the best ones. Um, I'm probably going to have to redo this. The skill setup. Uh, probably have to take that one off. Um, we'll do that later. Um, I'll, I'll actually probably do that off camera so gonna attach celestial saw the armor set yeah, yes that is also an achievement there's shoulders there's chest piece And these are unlocking the skins for them too. There's the hands. There's the legs. There is the boots. Um, as you can see, exotic attire, 12 of 18. Again, that is an achievement. For the main, we are going to go Axis for the main. For the secondary, we'll put the bow in. And there we go. Now let's get her all ruined, equipped. Going Scholar. And scholar. And scholar. Uh, hands. Scholar. S 
Gollar. And final one, and this will unlock. This will give us plus 125 ferocity. Increase strike damage by 5% while your health is above 90%. There's that one. This one we're going to use Sigil of Impact. And this one we're going to use Sigil of Force. There we go. There we go. Health is at 19,000. Crit damage percentile 208%. Base damage may be 1,704, but we'll take care of that. That that will definitely increase. Let's get her looking pretty good. Uh, I did make a lot of dies, so <laughs> there are a lot of dies you can do. Do some swamp black on her. And we'll try to make her look beautiful. That looks better. Uh, I want that more as the main color on her. And that's that, that's that. Do that as main color. Brilliant brass. We'll use that as an accent color. I consider myself a free voice for these <laughs> And we will use another green. Actually green. The green. That looks good. That looks good enough. If you guys don't like it, then make a suggestion what you think will work better. But there she is. And yeah, we're going to keep the cape on. And we need to tear all these down. So we are going to use our thing in hopes we get some good crafting ingredients still working on my warriors ascended gear so these three weapons they're a festive event weapons and no they will not be broken down um oh i need that for my thing so and we'll stick all these up there. I don't have nothing for her level 80 underwater stuff yet, so we'll work on that a little later. There ain't gonna be too much underwater combat, so. And there we are. There is our beautiful Jessica with our axes. So with that, let's continue on the storyline. Which is going to be where? Down here. Right? Ain't nowhere else? Oh, all the way down here. And we haven't unlocked anything down here yet. So, I guess it's a good time to go venturing. Um, Actually, this waypoint's good because I might try to go and uh, we'll attack this uh, hero point. Get some more uh, hero points because now we need a lot of them for Soul Beast. For our new pact. Yes, yes, I know. There is a specific animal you want to have with your Soul Beast because it helps you out. So, let's get going. I have a lot to do. And yes, I am going to grab crafting materials. 
Because you can never go wrong with grabbing crafting materials. You can only go wrong if you don't. Um, and she's hungry, so we're going to feed her some of her food that she made. Um, she's going to have some strawberry pies. Coleslaw. No, we're not going to do the fest. Beast. She's almost up there. And there we go. That works. She should be all fed now. With that, she got a lot of bonuses. So, that's good enough for her. Mount up and take off. Ah, there's another tree. Okay, get the tree. Don't think we have a snow leopard. But be on the lookout for a juvenile snow leopard. Might need that. Come on, Pooh Bear. Let's go. Let's go, Pooh Bear. And there is an event nearby, too. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um. She mean one. She mean one. Both still the beast here. Still the beast. I think she's going to sport the bow for a bit. Seems to be doing a lot more damage anyway, so. Of course, it's probably because of my skills pre setup. So, we'll keep supporting the bow for a bit. Let's go look for another one. After Pooh Bear. Stay away from me. Just wait until my axes get skilled. Do this. Three of five. Yeah, I think I'm more skilled than my bow on this, so. Not over there. Go over here and help the explorer. One more. One more. One more. Come on, come on, Pooh Bear. All right, we need one more. There it is. Everyone, Ah! 
Boo Bear, why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? I right, ready for a veteran. Thank you. Ah, Boo Bear. Don't do that next time. Ah! Uh, I see the boss. We gotta go after that boss. Gotta go after that boss. Stay away from the Drake. Oh, he gonna be a pain. We can do it! We can do it! We're good! Yeah, we got this. We got this, dude. We got this. We're that good. Oh, we need that checkpoint. There we go. Uh, we need to start going over there. Don't worry about the ballast. Keep them on undead corpse. Do that. Uh, yeah, we're not getting through there. Ah, move, move, Jessica. There we go. Let's get in here. Get in here. Looks good. Looks good. Okay. Everything looks good. Bots are not allowed in this area. They're allowed now. And let's go through our portal. Maelstrom! Oh, hate this one because it's a bunch of lava. And yeah, it'd be best to go this way. Be best to go this way. Ignore everybody. I want this fast travel point, please. Oh, juvenile pink moa. Oh, do we have a juvenile pink moa? We do. I didn't think we did. And let's go fly, fly, fly. Land matter. And keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, moving, keep moving, moving. Yeah, we'll get there. We'll get there. Oh, Nightmare Court. Uh, yeah, we're not going to worry about the Assert Lab. We are on our way to our mission. Which 
which is right here. Good. Let's continue on with storyline. Let's see what happened. Oh, <laughs> nice. Uh, quick and easy. Quick and easy. Uh, this ain't. There we go. There we go. Got the elemental off. Go in here and check, see what's going on. Good luck. courage go. Well, Master Kason, Trahan said you're having communication problems. I'm here to help. Glad to hear it. This duty is too dangerous for cross signals. I have the best trained artillery crews in the entire pact, but they keep making rookie mistakes. I don't get it. There's a mortar team heading out right now. Their target is a horde of undead massing in the southwest. Join the team, escort them to the kill zone, and help them set up. I'd like to see a mission go smoothly for a change. You got it. Me and Pooh Bear are on the job. Well, Island was a tough win, wasn't it? We all lost friends that day. I heard you had.